Let me uh, uh, shed light on uh, the uh, conference, the investment conference that happened uh, two months ago between the European Union and, uh, and Egypt. This was a two-day conference uh, raising the strategic partnership between the EU and Egypt to the highest level. This is economically, uh, social uh, and the green hydrogen and uh, renewable energy. The government of Egypt is dedicating all the green hydrogen projects for only for experts. No mention about <coughs> localizing green hydrogen for the hard to abate industries in Egypt. So, more than 15 million tons of green ammonia carried on it, green hydrogen will be exported to our main markets in the European Union. So this is the full dedication will be 100% exports to uh, EU. We have about three uh, Chinese consortia that are interested to do business in Egypt, but they are a little bit lagging behind European international developers that have signed framework agreements and MOUs. So the queue is a little bit getting longer and they have no chance to do a project that will uh, benefit from the golden license and the incentives because the government of Egypt stipulates that golden license, the incentives of green hydrogen will be for five years from the signing from the signing of the uh, framework agreement. So they are a little bit lagging, but they are insisting to use uh, Egypt as a hub to penetrate Europe because the sanctions that are going to be implemented. So uh, Chinese are going around to have a hub from Egypt to the European market. Egypt has been always inviting Italian companies and our uh, main two great partners and investors are SNAM and INAI. We really find that Italy, the Italian companies are a little bit uh, struggling to invest in Egypt. Maybe they are investing in Algeria, maybe in Tunisia, but not although there are a lot of huge economic relations and Egypt was one of the great importers of Italian commodities. I myself have been importing machinery. I have great relations, 26 years going to Italy uh, frequently and porcelain and ceramics. Uh, we have a lot of uh, common uh, benefits, common uh, grounds. And uh, uh, it was strange that last five years the Italian companies are not are not having the appetite to to do business in Egypt although we have great relations